Hello, lovely people. It's Katie. You're like, Katie, why are you coming at me looking like this was filmed on a toaster? In editing this video, I realized that I never filmed an intro nor an outro, which is A-OK. -okay. Sometimes we just want the meat of the video, the good part. But I figured I'd let you know that this video is all sorts of decorating my new apartment from every which way you can believe. There's a lot going on. There's a lot of great moments, funny moments. It's just filmed randomly and in the order of how shit was getting hung up and done in this place. So if you think this is a hot mess it is but it's the hot mess in a good way enjoy and i love you toodles we have more apartment progress my uncle is coming over today and my aunt to help me hang a bunch of things because some things you can't use command strips for and i think it'll just make it start to feel like a home i still haven't found anything for above my couch which is kind of annoying everywhere i look nothing feels perfect or right and since this is such a big wall i want it to be perfect y'all saw this in my last video this frame that i picked up from home goods i feel like i've been living at home goods recently i've probably been there three times in the last like two weeks I feel like after today, it won't be completely done, but it will start to feel more done and more like home. I love this huge window that I have in my bedroom. It's so nice. It lets in so much good light, but at nighttime, it still brings in so much light. My complex has cute little fairy lights twinkling all night, obviously, so people can see what they're doing when they're pulling in and out. The fairy lights don't ever turn off, so it shines right in my eyes at night. I bought blackout curtains, which we're also going to hang today, so I'm very excited about that. Tonight will be my first night sleeping with those. I have pretty bad sleeping problems, so I'm hoping that even that little step will make a big difference. The curtain rod's gonna go above there, and then I bought just like simple white blackout curtains, so I'm hoping that that looks good. And let me show y'all the few other things we're gonna hang. If you've been following for a while, you probably know this print. This was hung in my last apartment. I love this print, and that is gonna go on this wall in my bedroom. I feel like we've all seen this one just sit here for a little while. I bought this at Home Goods. It's a very big, beautiful ocean print. It's just been on this little cart that I have so far that still isn't finally decorated. This is gonna get moved up and hung against the wall. So slowly but surely, we're making it a home. Wow, easy peasy. The other one that you hung that you've done before is in here. This wire stretched a little, so I just wanna see if you like, if this is okay or if you want me to move it up some. It's a little bit lower. That looks fine. But yeah, no only reason to put an extra hole. No, 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 one. yeah, that's perfect. All right, let me just make sure it's even. Let okay. me get one. But you have to say hi. Hi. <laughs> Do you want to be in my vlog? No, I want to be on your vlog. Have you ever been in my vlog? I've been, oh yeah, when we went to Ikea. There's like a picture of me like in the background with my sunglasses. Uncle David used to interview everybody at the really? family reunion. Did I you ever see those? No. Videographer really? of all of our family, you know, Chunk. Yeah, he should redo it this year. <laughs> Wanna be cool? Do you wanna sit? How involved is this? Well, you're not even in the camera. I'm <laughs> you're too tall. I'm sorry. You don't have to be sorry, you just my have to sit. <laughs> my entertainment creds are a little weak. Give the backstory. What What do you mean? That this is your favorite Easter candy. All right, Cadbury eggs are my favorite Easter candy. <laughs> well, I want Katie to try it. She's never tried it before. What she said, yeah. Oh my God. Jonathan. What? You're giving zero effort. I'm, I, I'm not sure what you want from me. Take two. <laughs> Oh my God, Caitlin, this is the best candy you'll ever have. I can remember back in the day when I was a kid enjoying <laughs> these candies. That's They're it? delicious. I, I don't have a whole lot. Just eat it. Just eat it all. It's pretty now good. You stick your tongue in. Like, Why is it orange? That's the, that's the yolk. But it's not, it's really not a real yolk. <laughs> Like yolk. No, just, just squirt it. Just, just like stick the whole thing in your mouth right now. Go, 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 go. Peer pressure. Do it like a shot. Go, go. No, just slam the whole thing. No, I'm scared. You can't nibble it. Just slam it. You have half. All right. It's good. Oh, it's mm. good. Mm. <laughs> it's not a hardship. It's delicious. It's a lot. Say bye. Bye. You have to edit out the inappropriate parts. No, that was no. hilarious. Leave it all. <laughs> Mission accomplished. Everything has been hung and I can't wait to show you guys. Let's do a quick little overview. First and foremost, this photo is hung. Here I have the little shell print that I got at Home Goods, and I love this. I think it's so cute, it matches perfect. This beautiful print got hung behind my door and then put my little neon sign right here 
and this got hung. Most importantly, the curtain rod went up. Unfortunately, your girl bought the wrong size curtains, so I ordered new ones on Amazon that will be coming in tomorrow. So hopefully I can get those up by myself. Just having the rod up there is super, super helpful. The other day I was back at Home Goods and I got a few decor pieces to go on this shelf because like I said, I wanna make it more full, more adult. My aunt, who I love dearly, called it um, a beach shrine. Made me die laughing, I think it's hilarious. So let me show you the few things I got and then we're gonna try and redecorate it a little bit. Home Goods. First thing I got is this big seashell. $12, I was like, I can't not get this. I don't really know if you're supposed to put stuff in it, but I just think it's pretty and it, I think it matches the vibe. So we got that. I really like this. This is a vase and I just love the shape of it. The shape just looks really cool and it would provide a different kind of texture and style. This was also on sale. I need to get all these stupid stickers off. I hate when people put stickers directly on the things because I don't know it just leaves like a sticky residue and it's so annoying I'm gonna work on that these two were completely random pickups but I saw them and I had to get them I got this cherry scented soap on a rope this is vanilla scented this is a cute little cowboy and a cowboy boot I thought these will be perfect gifts just to have if you ever needed to give somebody a quick little gift I like to buy things that are on sale or super cute and keep them stocked up so when it's time to give a gift I don't necessarily have to go out and get something and who wouldn't love these they're pink and smell good and everyone can use soap. I thought these were too precious. I could not pass them up. And the last thing I got was this, which I can't tell if I love it or hate it. I don't really know which way it goes. I think like this. It's just like a pink ball. $10. And I don't know. I thought it was cool. It would add a different texture. It would bring out the pinks in here. I'm going to mess around with this shelf and hopefully make it look better. I don't know. I'm trying my best here. Oh, wait. I also got this little plant, which... I need to take the tag off, but I bought this at Home Goods as well. Okay, we'll have a makeover soon. Ready? Three, two, ta-da. This is where we landed. I would love to get pretty flowers or something that would be a little bit taller to come out of here, but I put all of my seashells that I've collected and this, and I think it's really adorable. It holds a ton of them, and I think it fits the vibe, right? Like the seashell holds the seashells. This is it so far. It's still beachy. It's still cute. It has more color and more character. This is my second set of curtains that I ordered because the first ones were way too short, so I'm hoping these work better. I want to make sure they're tall enough first. <coughs> I think they'll be good. I'm gonna get a stool because I can't reach that. So I think I just do one on each side. I've never had curtains before in my life. So I think that's one side. Oh no, don't fall off. I think this would definitely be easier if you had two people. It's like a big sword. Let's hope and pray I can get this thing up by myself. Oh gosh. I can't see. What is happening? Ow, ow, ow. Does that look good? I gotta fix it a little. <laughs> Your girl's got curtains and they fit perfect. Oh my gosh. Wow. That looks amazing. I'm so happy about this and I'm really hoping that when it's dark out and the light is peeking through that I can sleep better because that's been a really bad problem for me. I also bought cute little ribbon to tie them off on each side. I love this, this looks amazing. Oh my gosh. The curtains I bought off of Amazon were like $35 and I think the rod, the curtain rod was $20-ish. So I think the whole thing was under 50 or 60 bucks. I'll have it all linked on my Amazon storefront down below, but that looks really good this is the ribbon that i bought i just cut it into two equal pieces blue kind of like checkered print and i think it's really just gonna tie in the blues of this room i'm just gonna tie a little bow tell me that's not the cutest thing you've ever seen in your life obviously it's dark out there's not great lighting in here right now but i think that is precious i love it and i feel like my bedroom is slowly coming together it might be completely done looks amazing Y'all, I was just sitting outside working on my patio and my new rug got delivered. This is supposed to go on my patio. I really hope it works. Amazon low-key be exposing everybody because they send everything in clear packages now. This is what she looks like. Oh, wait, it's low-key tiny. She is. This might be too small. Oh, goodness. She <laughs> is so small. This is tiny. Why did I think it was gonna be so much bigger? I'm so embarrassed. Please look how small it is. Why is it tiny? I thought it was gonna fit under both of the chairs. In theory, can you see what I mean? Like pink and pretty, but obviously it needs to be bigger. 
what the heck was I thinking? I failed big time. That's it. That's this video. I hope you enjoyed. I think you guys can tell how much happiness this place is bringing me and how amazing it looks coming all together. There's only a few things I really need left. A big rug and then some freaking art for this wall. I found two things that I like, so I'm hoping that that will fit and look good. I love you. Thank you so much for watching this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it and you've been enjoying this moving content as much as I have. If you're new, subscribe and follow all my other social medias. I love you and bye. Mwah.